At this year's E3 show in Los Angeles, Microsoft made a big announcement about its Xbox interface. And I think what Microsoft is doing is not about reinventing the wheel, it's about no wheel at all. They even invited Steven Spielberg to talk about Project Natal, that's the code name for a sensor bar that you can plug into any existing Xbox game console, clearly inspired by the success of the Wii, uh, letting, you, it, uh, letting you flip through menus, uh, throw paint, uh, detects your voice. Here's what the camera sees, and clearly you can see this is no PlayStation Eye. But I still had my doubts. I just had to try this new thing for myself. I don't want to sound like a skeptic. However, uh, I was watching the B-roll of the race driving. Yep. And I didn't. It just didn't feel right to me. Uh, that when the when, you know, sometimes you want to click or you you know in some so tasks. Here, can we fire up our driving demo? Let's bust it out. <laughs> All right. To my surprise, Microsoft let me drive, so I walked into the middle of the room and uh, tried to start driving a car. <laughs> it was a little bit strange, I have to admit. Um, at first it didn't work, but what was going on was the sensor was scanning my skeleton. It was connecting the dots, extrapolating where my hands and so on would be, uh, making it so that the Xbox microprocessor could quickly calculate um, when I made a move. and. Uh, by George, it worked. I was uh, driving with Burnout Paradise, uh, simulated about 80 miles an hour down the middle of a busy street in Manhattan, and I was able to weave through traffic. I was able to avoid obstacles and push, put my foot forward to hit the gas or pull it back to hit the brake, um, and so uh, even did a power slide at the end. Um, I have to admit, while this is no Wii kind of experience, it's a new thing and really can't be compared. Um, I think it's worth keeping an eye on.